what we're doing now is we're flashing, well, whirly birds, vents, whatever you want to call them, uh, basically a curb. We're flashing these three units, one, two, three, and they all look alike. When you start, obviously you start at the deck, you put in your base attachment. Spec is four per curb or pipe or 12 inches on center, obviously, if it's bigger than that. The nice thing is when you have multiples of one curb is to have somebody cut out the curb, cut a pattern. By the pattern, what I'm saying here is you can see how I have multiples of these. So what I'm gonna do is come in here, go on the back side of this, weld this down, all right? That leaves my vertical here. Now, it's a little high right here and I'll trim it down. You can hang this dry or you can hang it with glue. So I've got this one here, then my next one can go over here, go on the other side, whatever. We're gonna have four of these in a minute. As you can see behind me, what they've done. Now, glue will help hold these up and then you can notch it here because you're gonna have to put a corner on it anyway. So take the outside corners, take our, our fluted corners. Again, you have everything that looks the same. Put the corners on. It's faster, it's easier, and everything looks the same. The building owner probably doesn't know roofing, but he knows when something looks nice, something looks neat. So by taking these, having one guy trace it, making a pattern, and then cutting out for however many curbs you have, put them in a bag, whoever comes over to weld, takes out the number he needs, drags it over, installs it, they're all gonna look pretty much the same. And that's what you want. You wanna do a nice job, you wanna do a clean job, and you, you wanna get paid. I'm Dave. And I'm Wally. Check out our videos at gif.com slash roofing it right.